up Ho Rose. Remember self service? You guys ever have that where they actually check the oil and have the person that fills it up and give you this thing and bottles of water and clean your windshield? Well, guess what? They still do that in Thailand. Show them, OJ. Show them. Yeah. Bye. And that doesn't cost any extra, that's just normal. You never get out of your car here. Crazy, huh? I know. Service. It still exists somewhere in the world. So, on one of my videos I talked about Father's Day in Thailand. Today's Father's Day. The king of Thailand has uh, a yellow shirt for him. Yellow is his color. He was born on a Monday. I used to have a yellow shirt, but there's none my size now. I'm double XL American, which is about the size of three Thai people. We're gonna walk in here and you're gonna see all the people in their yellow shirts today. It's December 5th, by the way. King is 87 years old today. 87. Longest reigning king in written history in the world. Check it out. Yellow shirts, here we go. MK I talked about another blog. I didn't post that yet, but you're gonna see it now. It's a great place to eat. Yeah, yellow shirts. So today for Father's Day, we're gonna go on a little adventure. We start our day with Suki, MK Suki, one of the biggest chain restaurants in Thailand. It's fresh food that you cook in a boiling pot. I showed you sort of the uh, homemade version earlier in the food vlog, but this is a more uh, chain restaurant, really fresh, good for you, healthy, not like those other guys, McDonald's and all that stuff. This is the good stuff and it's way more popular in Thailand. So check it out. So I'm going to show you a little bit of that and then we're going to go to the beach, which is about an hour, hour and a half outside of Bangkok for Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to you fathers out there. Look at that. Wow. You think that's a lot of food? It is. You think we're not going to eat it? You're wrong. We are. All of it. Every last delicious morsel. Like Inception, a picture within a picture within a video on YouTube. Of course, no lunchtime Father's Day is complete without an ice cold brew. That is, if you're old enough to drink, drink responsibly. I am old enough to drink, and I do drink responsibly most of the time. Do you guys know the art form of using chopsticks? I learned how to use chopsticks a long time ago in like 1995 on uh, a Korean movie. I had no choice, so I was with all Koreans. So they taught me. Now I live in Asia where I use them all the time. Mm, and we eat the whole shrimp including the tail. What? You guys use chopsticks where you're from? Or do you know how to use them? Check this out. Mm. The 
interesting thing about suki is it's always changing. Because you have vegetables, you have meat, you have seafood. And then you eat a little bit of this, a little bit more of that. Look at it now, it looks completely different. So it's up to you. It's an evolving meal. You want more meat? You want more seafood? You want more vegetables? Mix it up. Tofu, everything. There's like six different sauces here. Check out these sauces. It's a plethora of sauces. Would you say El Guapo that I have a plethora of sauces? Yes, I would. Aloy, delicious. Christmas in Thailand looks like? It looks a little something like this. Christmas bells, those Christmas bells ringing through the land bringing peace to all the world and the to I'll show you what I really want for Christmas is this. I've been wanting this for a long time. It just came to Thailand. It's the Samsung Curve Screen. Flat screen curve, check it out. Okay. Fine eye. Sleeping Beauty. So where are we now? We at the Hello Chonburi. Chonburi. Chonburi is where the beach is, not so far from Bangkok. Hoakin Beach. No, Hoakin. Oh, there's another province. Oh, oh here yeah, have Pattaya. Pattaya. Bang San Beach. Bang San Beach. Beach. Sun is setting. May not make it. May have to go back to Bangkok. Thailand traffic. hours later since we left Bangkok it was supposed to be an hour ride to the beach which it was but once we got to the beach we spent three and a half hours in traffic just to get to the beach and we're still not at the beach the beach is there you can almost see it it's about a hundred yards away but the Sun has gone down so probably we're gonna look at the beach for five minutes we'll probably go eat some seafood and then go back to Bangkok because we spent the day in traffic. Happy Father's Day in traffic. Well, if you could smell this, it smells like fresh seafood. This is right on the ocean. Seafood market. Everything smells good, but you can't 
can't get to the parking area. Really. So uh, Well, my home bros, like I said, it took all afternoon, but we finally made it to the water's edge. Here we are. And Whoa. Nice little place. We made it just in time to have a little seafood dinner. Head back to Bangkok. Right, little fa? That garbage can looks fishy to me. Look at this cool little village out here. The village is the obligatory market. This whole place smells like delicious seafood. We're gonna probably have some. Check it out. Home. Home means smells good in Thai. Home. Mak -mak. Thanks for joining me on this happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to all y'all fathers out there. We enjoyed our little trip from Bangkok to Bang Bang San on the beach, eating the seafood. Much love and respect to y'all. Don't forget to subscribe down there, y'all. Tell your friends about the Hobro. Peace and love, and I'll see you next time. Love ya.